Can you recognize these 15 math formulas? The first one is m equals y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. Take a moment and see if you can recognize this formula. This is the slope of a line passing through two points x1, y1 and x2, y2. The next formula is x equals negative b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac over 2a. This is the quadratic formula to solve the quadratic equation ax squared plus bx plus c equals 0. The next formula is c equals 2 pi r. This is the circumference of a circle with radius r. The next formula is a over sine of a equals b over sine of b equals c over sine of c. This is the law of sines that is used to find the sides and the angles of a triangle where the lowercase a, b, and c are the sides and the uppercase a, b, and c are the angles. The next formula is v equals pi r squared h. This is the volume of a cylinder with the radius r and the height h. Next, d equals square root of x2 minus x1 squared plus y2 minus y1 squared. This is the distance between two points x1, y1 and x2, y2. The next formula is a equals h over 2 times b1 plus b2. This is the area of a trapezoid with the height h and the basis b1 and b2. The next formula is a equals square root of s times s minus a times s minus b times s minus c where s equals one half times a plus b plus c. This is the Heron's formula used to find the area of a triangle with the sides a, b, and c. The next formula is a squared plus b squared equals c squared. This is the Pythagorean theorem used on a right triangle with the legs a and b and the hypotenuse c. Next, we have x1 plus x2 over 2 and y1 plus y2 over 2. This is the midpoint of a line segment with the endpoints x1, y1 and x2, y2. Next, y minus y1 equals m times x minus x1. This is the point-slope form of the equation of a line passing through the point x1, y1 and having the slope m. The next formula is 1 half times b times h. This is the area of a triangle with the base b and the height h. Next, v equals 4 over 3 pi r cubed. This is the volume of a sphere with radius r. The next formula is a equals theta over 360 degrees multiplied by pi r squared. This is the area of a sector of angle theta and the radius r. And the last formula is y equals mx plus b. This is the slope-intercept form of the equation of a line with the y-intercept b and the slope m. Thank you for watching and please share in the comments what formulas you recognized and which ones were new to you?